Weather is indeed here and more people are spending time outdoors. That also means everything else is active too out there, including insects that could be harmful to your health. One bug bite from the right insect could change your life. And that's exactly what happened to a Howell County woman about a year ago. Nyjah McDonald is here with that story. Nyjah. David and Heather, Christy Bonin says her life has been flipped upside down after what she thought was a minor bug bite. Beware when you're out there having fun that there are animals that do cause diseases that you may not know. I did not know about this tick and now I do know in a hard way. It's a hard lesson to learn. Christy Downen was bit by a Lone Star tick over a year ago. However, it wasn't until just recently she received a diagnosis. The rashes were real bad. It was getting to the point where I told her, you guys are missing something. I'm still dying. So she goes, let me do this tick bite test on you. Downen says she tested positive, but her issues didn't stop there. I'm allergic to almost about 29 other food items plus chicken plus all mammal meat, plus dairy. Down and now carries an EpiPen with her wherever she goes. She says she hopes sharing her story will provide more awareness to potential dangers of bug bites. Be so aware and be careful of the ticks and wear your protection, please. Dr. Trisha Durgis of Ozark Valley Medical Clinics stresses the importance of preventative care. Permethrin is a great thing that actually does kill the larva all the way up to the adult tick. DEET is, is good, it's still good and safe. You don't wanna use it for anyone under two months old. And 10 to 30% is really all you need. Durgis says when outside, try avoiding shaded and humid areas. The more things you can keep out in the sun, like your children's playground area, get that out right in the sun. So that way the tick, they dehydrate. You can also put wood chips around areas as borders. Now, just says to check all clothing and gear as soon as you go inside, adding not to forget to check your pets as well. She also says to shower within a two hour period. Head over to our website at OzarksFirst.com for a complete list of Dr. Durge's tips. Good advice today.